Hey everybody, welcome back. Big news, Warner Brothers and Paramount are coming together to create the ultimate Transformer. Yeah. To be known as Devastator. Yeah. Star Trek will be fixed. Batman and DC will be fixed. Doesn't it mean all those things, Nick? <laughs> probably not. Probably unfortunately. Not. Um, probably not, but you know, we'll see what happens. Uh, I think this is actually good for them because Paramount's in, in the trash. Warner Brothers mm -hmm. isn't doing that good. You got Aquaman 2 that they've already given up on that's <laughs> that's coming out that's going to be a complete flop. Um, James Gunn you know, has his plans to reboot DC. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Who knows how well that'll be received. Um, Star Trek is hanging on by a thread. Yeah, that thread is like microscopic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just not in a good place. But yeah, uh, uh, Deadline reported and this news broke last night um, of this merger meeting between uh, David Zaslav and Paramount Global's Bob Beckish sit down to talk possible deal. Yeah. Um, and uh, it just goes on to say that uh, that reports are that they, uh, you know, met at the corporate headquarters in New York. And, you know, the article goes on. I'm not going to read the whole article, guys. It's on deadline if you want to go read the whole thing. But basically, they're in talks to have a merger. Uh, ultimately, I think it's probably good for both companies because neither one of them are doing any good. My only question is. Who is going to be running this thing? Who's going to, if they merge, what executives, who's going to, who's going to take over? Who's going to be yeah. running it? Um, you know, uh, is it going to be, you know, dual ownership, dual people kind of running different sections of the, of the company after the merger? Who knows? Mm -hmm. um, but uh, yeah, I, I don't know. It's very interesting uh, that these two powerhouses might actually be coming together. And becoming one. <laughs> it might, you know, new blood with franchises of yesteryear. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe that would do Star Trek and Batman and Superman and some of the things that they own, they would own. Maybe that would do them some good. Because yeah. right now, if they stay course, it's just going to continue to go down. And people are going to have less and less interest. Interest has been dwindling over the past several years. Yeah. This is the kind of thing that could turn things around. Um, but at the end of the day, the creators have to create and give the fans something that we actually enjoy. Yeah, 100%. And the thing is, Paramount Plus actually has a lot of good stuff on there. All the Tyler Sheridan stuff's on there. Tulsa King was great. Uh, Yellowstone, all the spinoffs for Yellowstone. SEAL Team's on there, um, which yeah. is one of my favorite shows. Um, so they have some good quality content on there, but man, the company is not doing good at all. Um, yeah. so I don't know. Ho hopefully, hey. hopefully this will be good for everybody. When in doubt, when things are going bad, time for a merger. Yeah, I definitely think it's probably going to happen. That's yeah. my prediction. It, it's, it's happening. Yeah. And it could really, if they pull it off right, they could get right up there with HBO they could get right up there. They could pass Disney like that. But oh, right now, yeah. they're behind Disney. Both. Yeah. Easily. Yeah. And Disney's struggling horribly. Yeah, yeah Paramount's um, uh, stock numbers got down into single digits. I mean, it is that bad wow. for them. Hey, uh, that could be a good investment. Yeah. Uh, if this merger happens, that could be a really good investment. It'll be, it'll be going up. Right now, because of this news, guarantee you that. Yeah, I guarantee you we'll probably see a little bit of a spike on their stock prices mm -hmm. tomorrow. Yeah, for sure. All right, guys. Well, first of all, Merry Christmas. Uh, make it so, in the words of Paramount's Jean Luc Picard. Uh, <laughs> let us know in the comments what you think. Do you have hope for these two powerhouse entertainment entities to to turn this thing around? Time will tell. We don't know, uh, but I hope that they do. I really do. Yeah. Uh, it definitely give us a lot to talk about. Yeah. So as we always say here, we are you are Echo Base Network. May the force be with you and all the other things be with you. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.